feel like they want to give you everything, then their mind starts telling them, be careful, watch out, you don't need that, do it later. You have a problem because you can't handle your own objections to your own truth, to your own destiny. And that's why you can't handle hers. Wake up! That's why you can't get women. Because I don't want any hookups or relationships, just a genuine friendship. Pause. I hand it over to you. The ball's in your court. And when you have anxiety and fear, whatever you say will have the flavor of anxiety and fear. Ready? How do you feel right now? I feel so good. Good. How do you feel about us seeing each other tonight? I feel great. Good. That's you talking, not anxiety. Handle. Let me show you this combo. I'm going to skip to this, okay? She goes, can I ask you, can I ask, why do you want me to come? Come over to my house, right? Here's me. Because you're beautiful and I like you. Here's her. I do too. But as friends, right? Because I don't want any hookups or relationships. Just a genuine friendship. Pause. I hand it over to you. The ball's in your court. Anybody have answers for that? My answer is to keep seducing her, by the way. How would you continue? Would you stop? What would you say? Any ideas? She says, I said, because you're beautiful and I like you. She goes, I do too, but as friends, right? Because I don't want any hookups or relationships, just a genuine friendship. I said, did you like how it was when we were hanging out? Her and I hung out once. She says, yes, I did. And that's why I'm here today. Meaning what? Her and I talking. I said, well, then there's nothing to worry about or to think about. Let God do his work and nature unfold as it does. There's no agendas here. Just enjoying what is. She says, sorry, I was getting ready for work. But yeah, I understand. I just wanted to put that out there. That's why I mentioned it. How are you feeling? She says, I said, yeah, I'm not looking for a relationship or anything. I have too many already, LOL. I let God and nature decide, and it's always been right. I feel really, really sharp and focused. How are you? I've been thinking about you ever since that night, a lot. I say that. Look at how I go in again. She says, laugh out loud. I know you do. Like, have a lot of girlfriends. I just don't get how you can keep up with all of them. Ha ha. We're still in. And then she goes, that's good to hear. Smiley face. I say, laugh out loud. They need to keep up with me. She says, laugh out loud. I'm sure that's a lot of keeping up to do. And then she says, I feel much better right now. I don't know what it is. Every time I talk to you, I feel like a huge relief and peace. I go, I can feel it. Then I said, can you call real quick for one minute? She said, sure. And then she called me. And then when I got on the phone, I handled it. And by the end, you know where we are? I'm going to go see her tonight. And you know what's going to happen? I'm going to make out with her tonight. So how does she just want to be friends when I can go there? That's the point. You have to be able to handle all objections and obstacles. Otherwise, you don't have the art. Just because you said it's $20 and said, I can't afford that right now. And you said, oh, okay, then I'll talk to you another day. You're not a salesman, bro. Get them to buy it. That's your job, to overcome objections and obstacles. Why the f*** would you be selling otherwise? Why the f*** are you seducing if you can't overcome? Like, well, I just want to be friends right now. But did you like the way it was when we hung out? Yeah. I liked it too. Just let God do his thing and nature take its course. And I don't have any agendas, but I'm definitely not looking for any girlfriends. I have too many. I know. I wonder how you keep up with them. Huh? I don't want to keep up with them. They have to keep up with me. Well, that's a lot of keeping up to do. Yeah, it is what it is. I don't know why I feel so at calm and peace when I talk to you. I feel so relaxed. Yeah, I can feel you. Can you call right now? Yeah, she calls. Boom. What's up? How you doing? Boom, 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 boom. How do you feel now? Oh my God, I feel so good after I talk to you. Good. Do you remember when you woke up this morning with anxiety? Yes, I do. Good. Do you remember when you said that thing you said to me on text about why do you want me to come over and all that? Yes, I do. That was anxiety speaking, not you. And when you have anxiety and fear, whatever you say will have the flavor of anxiety and fear. Ready? How do you feel right now? I feel so good. Good. How do you feel about us seeing each other tonight? I feel great. Good. That's you talking, not anxiety. Handle. Handle. That's it. But more than that, it's my vibe and the answer. If my vibe is off, if I feel like I lost her, if I feel like she objected in such a tsunami that I can't overcome, then, then that, no matter what I said, won't go through. Everybody, everywhere is feeling vibes. You're feeling my vibes right now. It's not my words you're feeling. 
You're feeling the vibes. That's why you keep coming back. If you felt the weakness in me, I was lying, I was untrue, you wouldn't be here. You wouldn't. Some people have been coming back, camp after camp after camp for years. They haven't missed one. Think about it. Are they stupider than you? Are the people that live here, that moved to San Jose, that are basing out, are those people that are in every camp, every part, are they being fooled? Did I fool them? Did I pull a prank on them? Are they brainwashed? If not, if not, what do they know that you don't know? That they invest so much. What the f are you missing though, bro? If I saw a bunch of people camped out on a mountain for years, years, and I checked their, their stats kept going up, their condition got better with women in life, what would I do? Well, what would I do? Would I be like, wow, what is wrong with you? You can feel the vibe. Now, don't do what these do. They feel like they're falling in love with you. They feel like they want to give you everything. Then their mind starts telling them, be careful, watch out. You don't need that. Do it later. You have a problem because you can't handle your own objections to your own truth, to your own destiny. And that's why you can't handle hers. Wake up. That's why you can't get women. Because you can't even get this tech. It's mind-blowing. You will never, ever be able to stop her objection because your own objection stops you. Nothing stops me. Nothing. Not one thing. No thing has ever stopped me from getting exactly what I want. To the point where I can look at a woman from distance and that woman will be mine. Come on now, wake up. How you view yourself is going to come across in everything you do. You can tell how Donald Trump feels about himself. Donald Trump does not feel bad about himself. It's all visible everywhere you look. It's part of the reason why people like Nate Diaz and Nick Diaz. You could feel the vibe, the frequency. These men are tough. They're not putting on an act. It's real. The words aren't even that deadly. Nate Diaz grunts half the time. So I'm going to go in there and just beat his ass. So. But that's scarier than that style bender gay guy. That guy could be like, I'm going to come over there and kick your ass. Be like, shut up, bro. You, you might be able to, but you're still gay, right? Like, that's like I just got beat up by a gay guy. You fight Nick or Nate Diaz, you beat their ass, you feel like you lost. The crowd is on their side. They're not afraid of you. They'll fight you right after fight again. They don't sound defeated, right? They're just like, what the f That's because that's how we're registering everybody. And you've been lying for so long as a strategy that it's become a habit. Got to break the habit of lying. You're lying habitually. You don't even know why you're lying. It's like, oh, there goes another lie out of my mouth. Okay? You got to learn step by step by step by step to love yourself. Now, is it true that you can't love somebody else if you don't love yourself? There, it's true and false like every other statement. I want you to stop worrying about what people say. Is this? Is that? And just start paying attention to what God gave you already. It's here. Everything I have is here. It doesn't matter what the words are that people say. Pay attention to the body language and the frequency. Pay attention. That's what the communication is, is this. It's the words are used to lie. Okay? People are lying through their teeth all the time, bro. Wake up.